Good morning from Disney World's All-Star Sports Hotel. I have to tell you, I've never been that big of a fan of All-Star locations, but after staying here last night, I mean, especially, um, you know, we got this room for 69 bucks on Hotwire. The accommodations were incredible. This bed is, without a doubt, and this is gonna sound really funny, we've stayed at a lot of Disney properties, the most comfortable bed that I have ever stayed on at Disney. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. And then the water pressure and the temperature out of that shower were unbelievable. And then the last thing, which is gonna sound bizarre, but if you live in Florida, you know how awful the Florida water is. It's awesome. It actually tastes like it's filtered water today for some reason. Yeah, you can drink out of, <laughs> out yeah. of the faucet. It's and amazing. if Mary says that you can drink it. Yeah. <laughs> So, cheers to All-Star Sports. This has been a great little date night mini vacation. It's one of the new minivans through Lyft. Right now, only at the Boardwalk Resorts, but they'll take you anywhere on property, I think for 20 bucks, which is actually close to the price of Uber. Maybe a little bit more. But they have fancy mini-type cars. Oh, yeah. oh, oh. Oh, oh, Epcot, we're back. It's rope drop. Five minutes to nine, everyone's kind of running in. Where do you think people run to first now? Is it test track? Are all you people going to test track or frozen? Probably frozen. People at rope drop literally just ran into Spaceship Earth. It's 88 degrees out right now without the heat uh, factor increased by the dew point. So base temperature, ridiculous. These guys are off like they're doing a Disney race. We have 10 minutes before our breakfast reservation. So we're gonna meet Baymax. He's gonna come out here in a minute. <laughs> and this is the outside of the Baymax meat area. Baymax is here. He's there. Look at his eyes blinking. That is awesome. Hey Baymax. Can we do the fist bump? All right, we have five minutes before our breakfast. So we're gonna get in joy and sadness from inside out. Exit long-term memories out there. Oh. All right. Don't be so sad. Oh. Be more happy. You smiling on the inside? Just to be clear, we did not rope drop to go meet those characters, but we had 15 minutes from the point that we were in the park to be able to get to the land where we have breakfast reservations, also with other characters. And we figured that would be a quick knockout, which it was, no line for either of them. And it's typically like 30 minutes plus for either of those character meets. We still made it here with one minute to spare. I have a chair, king of the castle. When you sit at your table, the bowls and plates are set up like a Mickey. So cool. Look who it is. It's video. So when you come for breakfast here, they give you all that you want. So they get set you off with this bowl of fruit. You get these sticky buns. Sticky cinnamon buns. <laughs> and then you get eggs and bacon and waffles and sausages and all that good stuff. But if you want more of anything, they bring you more. Look who it is. Did all of this food come from your farm, Mickey? It did? And you harvested it. Wow. They got you working hard here. <laughs> you churning the butter? All right. It looks good. What's your favorite? Fruit? Maybe cheese plates? All right. <laughs> 
my drinks have arrived. Coffee and orange juice in a mason jar. And that was a great character meet with Mickey. That's a great disadvantage when people go to meet Mickey at Magic Kingdom and he talks. But this one did a really good job at pantomiming, getting the message across. So by the way, this is amazing. It is Wow, I want to eat the whole thing. I know, so do I. I already had two pieces. And this is our breakfast. Um, if you want more of anything, again, they can bring it out to you. But you get Mickey waffles, bacon, tater tots. This is like Nutella, but they just call it hazelnut chocolate melted sauce, salsa, sausage, scrambled eggs. <laughs> Ready to do some exploring? Oh yeah, that's you. <laughs> You're the star. Yep. <laughs> Looking good though. <laughs> <laughs> so by the way, when we sat down, um, there was bushes over there and we were like, what's going on? Because now you can see the scene over there. We call it like the Tatooine scene. So Mary's like, wait a second, the scene swapped. And did we say how dumb we are, but we didn't realize the floor actually spins when you're in this restaurant. So the restaurant's spinning around, around all of the scenes within Living With The Land. Look who came to visit us. <laughs> oh. You want some? You can have it. Mary asked for more eggs and they brought out like six. You gotta eat them all now. He's back. Were you off adventuring? You were? Oh, you were Did you find anything good? Climbing the tree? Oh, you got some nuts and uh... <laughs> can't say that with a straight face. I know. <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> there you go. How about a little living with the land? Ten minute wait. Welcome to a voyage of discovery and awareness. It's the Rocky Horror Picture Show ride. There's a Up there is where we just ate. These dense and beautiful forests act with its plant and animal species. Rainforests are also extremely rich in productive living systems. Here's the Tatooine scene. Transplanting in progress. Welcome to our living laboratory, where scientists from we signed up to do the behind the, the seeds tour. Also, so we'll see what we get to see of all of this awesomeness up close. Ti is there. Coffee and rice. The growing wrappers at Epcot. Oh, we're gonna go see some fishies. Sturgeon, tilapia, hybrid bass. What? When we mentioned farming, what did they mix them with? But fish farming or aquaculture accounts for nearly the sustainable catfish breeding. I love catfish. As a result, Tank renovation in place. Look at this. There's shrimp in there. Wow, that's a giant shrimp. Innovations like this one. Carolina Reaper peppers. I like how it's labeled extremely hot pepper. This is the wheat. Winter melons, they're gigantic. That's ridiculous. It looks like Invasion of the Body Snatchers. NFT, Nutri Film Technique. 
with the culture. Rick growing dinosaurs. Source of fertilizer or Venus flytraps. And the plants help keep the wind. Um, we're going to be going, going out the, uh, behind the scenes. So get one of these things. This thing. You can shoot video once we get into the greenhouse portion of the tour. There's 14 of us on this tour. It's 25 bucks. And you do get a pass holder discount or visa, uh, Disney visa discount. So, we're in the greenhouse. The greenhouse is our creative greenhouse. Um, this is the greenhouse where we showcase a lot of different, really cool ways that you can um, do hydroponics in your own home. So, I like to start by saying, does anyone know what hydroponics actually is? So, once you get an eyeful of that, uh, you can probably also see across the way our aquaponics system. So, that's fish and plants together uh, in perfect harmony. <laughs> Mine didn't work. I think he's kind of tired today. <laughs> it's really cool. That is so cool. Wow, that's crazy. You just drag it slowly over. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, pretty crazy, right? Cucumbers, variety, seedless, bio cucumbers, good. I do not want a bio cucumber. A lot of the items that are grown in this greenhouse get sent to the restaurants on site for use. And there is the living with the land boat coming through. on the wall are called cooling pads. It's actually cool here. It's hot as heck out here. But if you stand next to this, pretty cool. Look at this tomato plant. They train it to grow around and around by using strings to pull up, move over, bring down. to the other section you can see the Mickey that's in the plants over there we get to see the big winter melons
to uh, supplement the stem to make sure that the uh, boards on the mill will stay on the vines on as possible. This is the drip irrigation area where they grow things out of sand. And there is another Mickey. Fig trees. Check out these coffee plants. That is a nine pound lemon tree, native to Florida. Seven to nine months to grow the. This is where they do their fish farming with more hidden Mickeys. Basically, do shrimp here. another hidden Mickey inside the catfish tank and yet another hidden Mickey in between the tanks with the hose we're feeding tilapia ah, when you go into this room it's about 30 degrees cooler air conditioning there's bananas it's the little baby bananas. They give you some jars to smell. I got ginger. Then I'll tell you what it is. I have no idea. <laughs> it smells like sandalwood. It smells like what? Sandalwood. Last hidden Mickey of the day. Mickey Mouse Black Pepper. So behind the seas was pretty good. It's just extremely hot yes. in that area. But it was a fun tour. I liked it. It wasn't the most fun tour, but it was fun. It was interesting. Yeah. Very, very interesting. If you're a biology science like Yeah, if you're into plants and stuff like that. If you're a kid. Uh, maybe not the most interesting thing to do. <laughs> it's time to journey into imagination. It's the Camarama 360. It's an incredibly faded picture. Oh, it's times like this that I have to say, I can't believe that I got a fast pass for this ride. <laughs> I guess more importantly, I can't believe there's that many people waiting for this ride. Our ride vehicles have arrived. It's about listening with your imagination. <laughs> now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't. It's over here. All aboard. Woo Next stop, imagination. For every sound, your ears are hearing. A thousand thoughts can start appearing. Now you're talking. It's crazy. It's more than you can imagine. But uh, it's exactly what I imagine. Imagination is the brain of the house. Bring me back Figment's head and put it on a keychain. I shall reward you heavenly. In mint. Outside of Universe of Energy, which is closing on August 13th, they've added a photo pass photographer to get your last memories in. You too can have an everlasting memory of a 45 minute journey into disappointment. The dinosaurs have come to life. 
Wow, look at this crowd. People are coming out because it's the hashtag last for this ride. When we came through here two weeks ago, empty. Now, crowded. Crazy. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Who knew that these dinosaurs were city supporters? That guy is dangerously close. I think he's looking for churros. Mickey bars? Not our dinosaur. We're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it. His name is a Cha Cha Binks. Look at this thing. It looks like the Ackley. It's a pterodactyl on the side. But from the other way, it looked like an Ackley from Clone Wars. The points. Well, right after the dinosaur scene, I fell asleep until we just parked. And they're selling commemorative items for the ride going away. The ride becomes extinct. I've got shirts. Yeah. We have hats. And there's Turvis tumblers. Our next fast pass is for Test Track. However, Mission Space is still currently closed, but the updates to the green side of the track will be done for August 13th. How futurific. <laughs> the regular wait for this ride right now is two hours. Just to give you a frame of reference of why Ellen's Universe of Energy is closing, they desperately need another big ticket ride here. And they don't have it now. They don't have enough now. My God, this ride just got incredibly more challenging. I think it's Korean. I don't know. Can you read that? That's an awful car. I know. Why? Well, I can't read it. <laughs> Look at that guy. It looks like the Batmobile. That says that's the greatest car ever, Kyle. Whoa! Are you kidding me? I have no idea. So looks like a smart car. Can you figure out what those things are? Uh, they will make that guy wide. That's a pretty bitching car. Do that one. It's asking you what kind of engine you want. Choose up there. That one looks like it's like a smiley face for a guy that has one eye. It's got like flying surfboards. Oh, oh electric car. Bugalugaloo. What's the second This is our car. Oh no! Alright. Wow, that's for like Shaquille O'Neal. It's very tall. Nice. Right. I'll never hit my head in the car again. Got a little bit of Tron happening on the car too. Are we good? Yeah. What does it say? Oh, interesting that that's in English, but everything else is in another language. This car looks suspiciously like Evac, the Transformer. And away we go. Surface. This is what the Tron coaster is going to look like. Connecting to OnStar. Simcar performance data acquired. Your designs hold up. Oh boy! Is that the future city of tomorrow? Now let's see how your vehicles can better when it comes to their efficiency. Oh no! Scanning the same car for optimal geo efficiency. Commencing responsiveness test. Okay. The response of his data is now being synchronized. Automated driving technology verified and active. Oh, I hope no trucks come out of us. I said 
No trucks. Automated. Three, two, one. Contact. It's excitement. I feel like there's a lot more cars here than there usually is. It's kind of like a regular Chevrolet showroom. So, that was it. I'll be honest, I don't think Test Track is a ride that deserves a wait more than like 20 minutes, maybe 30 minutes tops. It's fun. It's just not that fun, but it is fun. It's like medium fun. That ride is also very uncomfortable if you're tall. My knees were up against the board and it hurt. Inside mouse gear, I kind of feel like this is candy because yeah. it's something that's shaking around in here. Um, but it doesn't say. There's no description. Also, it makes noise. And it's $14. I like these Toy Story figures for Disney parks. We got that star. We got that star. All right, Epcot, we are out of here. It was a fun day but it is going to storm here momentarily. So it's time to hit the bricks. We didn't do any of the around the country stuff today because I figured we'll be back here soon enough for food and wine, and we'll take in all the countries at that time. But we are very glad you came along to hang out with us. So thank you very much for watching the video. Thank you for your likes. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for your subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. We'll see you guys.